so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! <laughs> hey! It's me, Blippi! And look at what I have! Whoa! This is a lot of tools! <laughs> I am so excited to use these tools today with you! But first, we need to shut the workshop garage door. Check this out! Oh, this is a chain. Whoa! <laughs> Sounds cool! You can make music with it! <laughs> okay, anywho, you pull one side down and then it shuts the door! Alright! <laughs> there we go! Whoa! Alright, back to the cool stuff. The tools! In this video, I am going to use these tools. And yep, they are real tools. Like this handsaw. Or this cordless drill. <laughs> but. I'm going to use all safety precautions that should be used at all times. And also, just because you're a wee young, you shouldn't use real tools. But what you can use are toy tools, like this hammer, ooh, pair of pliers, ooh, like this saw. <laughs> but for this video, I, Blippi, am going to use real tools with all safety gear on and safety precautions because I'm a grown-up and only grown-ups should use real tools. So first, let's listen to the Blippi Tool Song! Ah! When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. The wrench tightens pipes going clang, clang. A hammer hits a nail going bang, bang, bang. A drill is making holes going zzz, zzz. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear thuds and squeaks, cracks and rings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear bangs and booms, clangs and zings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. Cutting wires with some pliers going snip, snip. Cutting paper with some scissors going clip, clip. When you're working with tools, you've got to be real safe by wearing gloves on your hands and goggles on your face. And boys and girls, when you're working with tools, always follow mom and dad's safety rules. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear thuds and squeaks, cracks and rings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear bangs and booms, clangs and zings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. tools to choose from. But first, we need our safety gear on. And what's really important are safety glasses. Yeah. So what they do is help protect your eyes. See? Nothing's hurting my eyes. Awesome. Okay, so we'll have those on. And then what we need to put on are safety gloves. So let's put one glove on and then Let's put another glove on. So that makes one, two gloves. And you have to clap. <laughs> okay, and another set of safety gear is 
My earmuffs. We'll put these on later when we're ready for them. Okay, so now let's make sure we're nice and organized. Because you can't be unorganized when you're doing hard work like this. So let's bring this right over here. Whoa! <laughs> okay, let's put this right here. And then, now let me show you what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this piece of wood right here. See how tall it is? Whoa, it's about up to my chest. And we need to cut this into a smaller piece. Whoa, see how big that piece of wood is? Whoa! <laughs> All right, so let's set this piece of wood down right here. All right, and then we need to go get some tools. Do you know what tool to use to cut a piece of wood? Is it this? No, this is a broom and a dustpan. <laughs> That's for cleanup time. Okay, huh, let's see. Is it, is it this tool right over here? No, this is a hammer. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> you hammer in nails with a hammer. That can't cut a piece of wood. Yeah, yeah, a saw. This is a hand saw, and this is what we're gonna use to cut a piece of wood. So let's put it right over here. Okay, and then, do you see this? Whoa, there's a cable attached to it. Do you know what that means? Yeah, it doesn't work right now because it doesn't have power. So we need to attach some power to it. All right. What over here can pull power? Um, is it this? <laughs> this is a cordless drill. It gets power from its battery, see? But it can't provide power to this saw. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, you're right. Good job. This is an extension cable. We plug this into the wall and then the saw into this. And then it'll have power. Let's plug it in. Look at this right here. This is where you plug it into. Let's plug it in. Yeah. I did it! <laughs> All right, so now we need to find the other end. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> here it is. Let's go. Let me show you a trick. So we need to plug these two together. But if you just plug them in, it's probably gonna come unplugged at some point. So check this out. Goop, swoop, and then plug. Loop, swoop, and plug. See, now you can tug on it gently and it won't come unplugged. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, so now this saw is live. So if you pull the trigger, it goes. So we'll keep this right here for now. And then we need to measure this piece of wood. So let's go over here and locate the tool that we can use to measure. Is it this? No, this is a standard screwdriver. <laughs> yeah, it's just screws and screws. Okay, we need something that you can use to measure. <gasps> yeah, a measuring tape. Yeah, right here. This is a measuring tape. Check it out. Whoa! <laughs> Do you see these numbers? Yeah, these are numbers that tell you how short and small and long and big things are. Perfect. All right, let's take a marker. You know what that is. And now let's measure. Okay, all right. Here we go. So let's measure this piece of wood. 
Whoa, it's really big. So let's measure it to, I know, 12 inches. Do you see the number 12? Right there, 12. It's one after 11 and one before 13. Yeah, so let's make a mark. Perfect. And that is 12 inches. Hey, did you know in some places of the world, 12 inches is one foot? <laughs> yep, so today we're measuring in inches and feet. But in some parts of the world, they measure in centimeters and meters. <laughs> okay, all right, let's put these tools back over here. And let's put on our earmuffs. Hello? What did you say? I can't hear you. <laughs> okay, anyways, let me get back to work. All right, so here we go. This is where I need to cut that line. And this is the saw I'm gonna use to cut it. And let me remind you again, this is a grown-up tool. And you should not use grown-up tools. But you can use child play tools. Those are really fun. Yeah, those toys are so fun to play with. Okay, but for now, we need to get some work done. So, I'm gonna prop this up, line it up, and then when I pull the trigger, it's gonna go. Here we go. Yeah, look. Remember how this piece of wood used to be up to my chest? But now, it's up to my belly button. <laughs> See? Now it's up to my chest. <laughs> what? I can't hear you. <laughs> okay, let me take these off. All right, so we need this piece of wood. And actually, we need this piece of wood too. We need to screw them together like that. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, put that right here while we put this away. So first, let's unplug it. Perfect. All right, now, when you pull the trigger, nothing happens. So, let's wrap up the cable and the cord, and let's stay organized and put it away. And then, let's wrap up the extension cable. All right, nice and organized. Hello! <laughs> All right, put that right there. And now, we need to do two things. Remember how I said we need to screw in the two pieces of wood? So we need a screwdriver or a drill. And then the other thing we're gonna do is hammer in a nail. So we need a hammer and a nail. Let's find those items now. Okay, let's see. A hammer. Let's see. Oh yeah. Yeah, remember? Yeah. A hammer. This is a hammer. You know what a hammer is. Boop, 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 boop. It hammers in nails. Okay. And let's see. Here's a nail. Perfect. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Let's grab a second nail. Okay, so now I have two nails. Put it right over here. And then we need a drill and a screw. Do you see those? Yeah, here it is. Oh, wait a second. This is bolt cutters. <laughs> this isn't what we need. <laughs> okay, what we need, yeah, right here. The drill, the cordless drill. Whoa! <laughs> and then two screws, perfect. So we have everything we need. So let's move all this stuff back down to here. So 
We're gonna screw these in together. And then, we're gonna nail this on top, okay? So, let's screw it in. First, you take your drill, and you start drilling, nice and slow. Yep. Perfect. All right. And then, here's another one. Perfect. There we go. See? <laughs> Perfect. They stick together. Whoa. All right. So now what we need to do is put this right here, do it a little bit further. Okay, so now to keep this on top, we now need to hammer in two nails. Okay, so one nail, two nails, see? Okay, so let's put, let's start with the small one first. See how one's smaller than the other? Yeah, let's start with this one. Put it right there and make sure you don't hit your, your fingers. Perfect, there's one and then here's another. We did it! Check it out! <laughs> yeah! So we have three pieces of wood together! See? If I just hold this one, all three stay together! <laughs> and you know what I'm gonna do with this? Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Yeah! Oh! Oh, yeah! This is my new back massager! <laughs> Yeah! I love building things. Oh, yeah. That's the spot. <laughs> yeah, we did such a good job learning about tools today together. And remember, like I said, I used grown-up tools because I am a grown-up. But you should use toy tools and never use Grown-up tools, real tools, until you're a grown-up, okay? Will you promise me that? <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Let's spell my name together, all right? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. All right, now it's time for cleanup. Clean up, clean up, clean up your stuff, 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 clean up, clean up, clean up your stuff. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, Working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. The wrench tightens pipes, going clang, clang. A hammer hits a nail, going bang, bang, bang. A drill is making holes, going zzz, zzz. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, Working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear thuds and squeaks, cracks and rings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear bangs and booms, clangs and zings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. Cutting wires with some pliers going snip, snip. Cutting paper with some scissors going clip, clip. When you're working with tools, you've got to be 
real safe by wearing gloves on your hands and goggles on your face. And boys and girls, when you're working with tools, always follow mom and dad's safety rules. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hi, I'm Blippi, and this is a backhoe toy. It's one of the most popular machines on a job site. And today, we're going to explore a backhoe. is the front bucket, that is the back bucket, these are the tires, this is a stabilizer leg, and there's one on the other side too, that is the engine, this is the tractor, the inside is the cab. This is the front bucket, also known as the loader bucket. It can carry up to 8,760 pounds. That's three hippopotamuses. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Whippy! What it is? Yeah, it's a backhoe. And today, you and I are going to learn about Now it's time to learn the exterior parts of the backhoe. Come on. Wow, this backhoe is so big. Oh, and look at what else is big. Yeah, this is a big wheel and tire. Oh, and hey, up here, is a smaller wheel and tire. Ooh, look, wow. This is tread of the tire. And tread is used so then when it spins, it doesn't slip and slide. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I am sure dizzy. <laughs> whoa, come here. This right here is the cab. And this is where the operator <laughs> of the backhoe sits. Wow, so cool. Ooh, and look up there. That, though, yeah, those are the headlights. And that right there is the turn signal. So then you can drive this backhoe on city streets. Legally! Wow! Wow! This is a stabilizer leg, and it's normally up, but right now it's down in the mud. So then when the backhoe is digging, it's nice and stable. Whoa! I am so stable. Woo! And this of the backhoe is called the boom. That up there is the arm. And this arm is actually pretty special because it has an extender <laughs> That was awesome! Ooh, and look at this. 
This is the back bucket of the backhoe. It can get some pretty big scoops. <laughs> we'll get some together later. Come on. Whoa, that is the exhaust. That's where the engine pushes all of its exhaust from. Whoa! <laughs> oh, hey, look at this. This is the front bucket, and it's really big, even bigger than the back bucket. And this front bucket is actually pretty special. It is a four-in-one bucket, and it acts like a clamshell. I love clams. <laughs> Ooh. Wow! Look at this! These are hydraulic hoses. This is a hydraulic cylinder. And hydraulics are used to provide power by pushing fluid through them to the front and the back bucket. Wow! I love back hose! Now it's time to drive and operate the backhoe. Come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a second. Are we forgetting something? Yeah. First things first. Safety first. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. I got my hard hat on and my orange safety vest. All right, now it's time to drive and operate the backhoe. Come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a second. I think we're forgetting something else. Yeah, we need to make sure that the engine is good to go. So let's go check it. Come on. This is the hood of the engine. So let's open it up. Whoa, this is a massive engine. See, this is the air filter. This is the coolant. There's a giant tube from the radiator, the alternator, the battery. Wow, this is so powerful. But what you and I need to do is check the oil and it's down there. All right, so the oil is down there with the yellow O dipstick. The transmission is over there with the T dipstick. So let's grab the yellow O dipstick. <gasps> yeah. Hey, okay. we need to wipe it off. Put it back in. So now we can inspect the oil. Yeah, looks like it's okay. <laughs> All right, put it back in. And now that the backhoe is good to go, we can drive it. Let's go. inside the backhoe. Woo and first things first, safety first. We have to put on our seatbelt. Good job. The cool thing about backhoes are there's a front side and a back side. So we'll check out the front side. Whoa, look at this. This is the steering wheel. This is how you drive the backhoe. <laughs> Ooh, and this right here, this is the shifter. This is how you put it in forward or reverse. 
and over here, this, yeah, they're the turn signals. As well as, listen. <laughs> yeah, the horn. <gasps> and this, this is how you operate the front bucket. You pull it back to make it go up. You push it forward to make it go down. Yeah, it's so great. And now let's go check out the back, okay? Wow. As you can see, the back is where the boom is, the arm, the bucket, and the stabilizer legs. And how you operate those is primarily with these two joysticks. This one, whoa, whoa, whoa! And this one, whoa, whoa, whoa! Now both of them at once, ready? Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Ooh, and check out this little black button. Okay, listen. Yeah, good job. All right. Now, it's time to use the backhoe. Let's turn it on. Backhoes are the most versatile machine on the job site because it has the big front bucket and the small back bucket. Whoa! Whoa! Now it's time for the backhoe dance and how you do it is when you see a backhoe front bucket on the screen, you dance like this, okay? And when you see a back backhoe bucket, you dance like this. <laughs> All right, here we go. An excavating machine digging in the earth. <laughs> okay. Get ready. It's got a bucket attached to a hinge and a boom. It's called a backhoe and it's really cool. A backhoe at construction sites, digging trenches for laying pipes. <laughs> All right, here comes another one. But it cleans it up so easily. A backhoe, backhoe, backhoe dance. Backhoe, backhoe dance. Backhoe. <laughs> Last one. Oh. A back home, back home, back home dance. Good job. learning about backhoes with you. Thanks so much for watching the Blippi Backhoe video. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? All right. B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi, good job. See you again, bye-bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi. Hey, you must be the handyman. Yeah, my name's Blippi. What's your name? Hey, my name's Dee Dee. You want to come on in? Yeah, come on. Wow, all right. So this is Dee Dee's house. 
And like you heard, you and I are here to fix some things. I have my tool belt and even my tool kit. All right, so there's three things we need to fix today. The first thing is the sink. Yeah, the sink doesn't work. <gasps> Dang it. We'll fix that. The second thing is we need to fix Dee Dee's car. And then the third thing is we need to fix Dee Dee's workout machine. <laughs> All right, let's start with the sink. All right, since it doesn't work, we need to go down here. All right, let's open this up. All right. Okay, the first thing is we need to clear it out. All right, so we have this yellow cleaner we need to put over here and this red cleaner okay purple cleaner wow and then green okay ooh blue and orange my two favorite colors <laughs> huh why is this down here why does Dee Dee have dinosaurs <laughs> and then ooh a fire truck whoa Dee Dee's cool. And then, oh look, hey, it's even me. Hello. <laughs> and then, ooh, a snake. Wow, so colorful. All right, wow. Jeez, oh, look at all of this. This, these are all the hoses for the sink. All right, so let's see how we fix this. Let's take our hammer. Huh, it seems all really good. Yeah, weird. Okay, oh wait, I have an idea. Let's take our pliers, yeah, and let's twist this thing. Wow, all right. I think we fixed it with the pliers. So now, let's check it. All right, all right. Moment of truth. Yeah, we fixed it. Great job. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, <laughs> that's so much fun. All right, now let's go fix a couple more things for Dee Dee. Oh, dang it. Yeah, Dee Dee's car isn't working. Will you help me fix Dee Dee's car? Yeah, all right, let's grab our tools. And then first thing we need to do is open the hood. All right, here we go. Whoa, look at this. This is a dirty engine. <laughs> but we're not here to clean the engine. We are here to fix the engine. All right, so let's put the tools about right here. And then first let's uh, take our hammer and let's make sure the spark plugs are nice and tight. Okay, and then let's see. Okay, let's take our screwdriver and the air filter back here. Ah, uh, yeah, that's nice and tight too. Okay, hmm. What could be the problem? Huh. Oh, I have an idea. Yeah, the oil. Okay, let's check the oil. Sometimes cars won't run if the oil isn't nice and full. So, let's see here we go. Ooh, yeah. It looks really low. So, I think we need to add some oil. All right. And I have some oil in the car. Okay, perfect. There's oil in this white bottle. So let's open up the engine oil cap right here. And then, ah, yeah, yeah, ah, oh, look at that. Perfect. Oh, hey, my hands are dirty because the engine is really dirty. All right, are you ready? Oh yeah! Look, we're filling up the car with oil! Whoa! Okay, all right. I think that's full. Let's put the cap back on the car. Okay. Oh, all right. 
And then let's close this oil right here. Let's put it on the ground. And now, one last thing. Bubbles for good luck. Okay. Ooh. Perfect. Bubbles are really magical and they bring good luck. So now let's close the hood and let's see if the car runs now. All right, moment of truth. One, two, three. Yeah, good job. The car works now. All right. So we fixed the sink, <laughs> she was thankful. And then we fixed her car, she's gonna be so happy. And now we need to fix her workout machine. Wow! This is the workout facility that Dee Dee needs our help fixing one of these machines. Woo! I love workout facilities because this is where I take weights, <sighs> yeah, and I pump some iron. So then, there, make your body nice and strong, yeah! <laughs> That's so much fun. Ooh, ooh, what is this? This looks like this is the machine that Dee Dee needs our help. Wow, all right, let's put this down right here. And let's take our hammer. Yeah, this. Perfect. Ah, yeah. Perfect. Oh, and down here, we need to use our pliers. All right, we got it. Good job. Perfect. This is looking really good. Put that back. Now we have the screwdriver. And let's do this one over here. All right. <laughs> See, we did it. Right there. Perfect. The inspection is going really good. And the maintenance looks normal. So let's take the wrench. Looks like we fixed it for Dee Dee. Good job. Ooh, I think we should test it. All right. Yeah, it works really good. I love gyms and workout facilities because you get nice and fit, so then you can live a nice, happy, long life. So much fun fixing things with you today. Let's go over what we accomplished. The first thing was we fixed Dee Dee's sink. <laughs> the second thing is we fixed Dee Dee's car. And the third thing is we fixed Dee Dee's workout machine. Good job. Well, hey, if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Do you know how to spell my name? Yeah! Let's spell it together. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi. Good job. See you soon. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Blippi.